Today I'm going to clean my Breville, this is a burr grinder. So once you use this for three or four months, it's uh, when it's grinding, um, the coffee oil is going to get stuck in your, uh, on the burrs or the grinding mechanism. So you have to clean that one. So you might be able to see a little bit. Let me remove this. And you might be able to see some oil. That's coffee oil. Uh, so main thing is to remove clean. So this part, the hopper and the, the lid can go in the dishwasher. So I'll go ahead and do that at the very end. So you do need a, some sort of a, uh, it's a sharp rack or some sort of a vacuum. So I am using a Dyson uh, handheld one. It's very convenient. Um, and you also need, so I'm using Grind Z. So that's what it's going to look like. So the whole process is I'm going to remove the hopper, uh, get all the, first of all, uh, get all the coffee uh, in the, the system out, remove this one, put it in the dishwasher, remove, uh, clean the whatever that is in there with the vacuum cleaner, then remove the burr grinders, clean it with a brush, uh, put it back, then put this, uh, into this uh, into the machine grind it then then run uh, then to get this out you are going to run some coffee so let's start so I'm um, first thing I'm going to do I'm going to uh, to grind this so in order to grind the remaining coffee there we go you just press the the sensor there okay so it's all out okay so now I'm going to remove this now I'm going to use my, so you might be able to see, I'm going to remove this as well. So here is the inside of the mechanism. Here we go. I'm sure you can see it now. So that's the grinding mechanism. So as you can see, it's full of uh, coffee residue and oil. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use the... Uh, I had to put this on the tripod. I'm going to use the, well you get the point, I'm going to use the Dyson and we'll get the, all the residue out. Okay, so I'm going to use the Dyson. I got some of them out, so let me clean, clean a little bit and get them out. Well, okay, so now I may have to, let's see if we can see it, somewhat cleaned, but uh, we can do better. So I'm not sure how much you can see, let me put a flashlight, so that's the inside. So I'm going to turn it counterclockwise. I was able to then I can take this part out. Okay, so let me put the flashlight again so you can see all the the coffee that is stuck. Even though I press the grinder, it's not coming out. So I have to go and uh, clean this part. So let me break it up that one with. I was able to get most of the coffee out, but still there are a um, considerable amount of coffee is still there. But I am going to put this, and this one says align locked. I'm going to uh, put some of this um, grind Z in there, and then. Um, run it so let me try that plug it back in I got power I'm going to put there we go so that will go through the system I'm going to put something to catch this As you can 
see. It grinded all the all of those tablets. So let's take a look now inside. So I'm just going to, to lift this one up. Otherwise, I'll be so that needs to be discarded. So let's see what's the inside look like. Hopefully, I can get this thing removed. Yes, it did. Okay, still, I can see I don't see any coffee now, but I see uh, those that's like made out of corn. Uh, so, I'm going to clean that. I'm going to suck it out uh, with the Dyson, then clean it again so let me get back to you on that one so this time it is much cleaner I believe I'm going to run another batch of these tablets so that way it will um, uh, clean a little better than this so here's the second time I'm going to run it again just to make machine only at this time. Let me try it one more time. Okay, it will not let me do that. So I'm trying to see if I could run the okay, so I'm just running the machine just to get the last bit of the residue. So as you can see it's just coming just a little bit. Just to uh, get everything out. So it's out, so let's see what this looks like on the inside. So this is what inside looks like now, much cleaner. So I'm just going to use my brush and get all of these residue into the center, then use the vacuum uh, to get everything out. Uh, then I'm going to use the uh, I'm going to put some of the equipment in the mesh, uh, in the dishwasher, uh, clean it, then I will show it to you once I get everything cleaned out. So pretty much the cleaning uh, is done, just have to get the all the things that uh, in here out. Uh, then I had to run, put some more coffee and do um, uh, get the uh, these um, these tablets out. Then we are ready to make some fantastic coffee finally I got this thing pretty much clean um, not a good idea to use a little handheld Dyson use a shop vac or a bigger uh, vacuum cleaner so uh, so I think my problem was with the vacuum uh, the little Dyson was not doing its job uh, but I use a bigger one so you can see it's pretty clean so I'm going to wash um, put this this part can can be washed with water but then you have to make sure it is completely dry uh, before you putting it in so I'm just going to go and clean it I'm going to clean the hopper uh, part the lid and these little parts uh, let me wash this and uh, put it back together then you can see uh, what it's like I got all the parts cleaned so here is the part that I removed and got it washed so you can see that's pretty clean and here is the inside as well hope you can see it properly it's clean so all I got to do now is just assemble this part so this one goes in like that then it's get locked this lock position no, that did not go properly okay I had to align it properly 
the little arrow needs to align. It's a little tricky. Okay, let me fix that part. So this is the final step. I put some coffee beans uh, into my hopper. So um, got some some beans. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to run this one, uh, grind this one. This is to get any other uh, the particles that is remaining from those little pellets or the, the tablets. Uh, that's a corn based product. It's not harmful. It's a biodegradable organic. So I want to make sure that I get that I just don't want the taste of that one. So I'm just going to run the coffee uh, for a couple of times. So I did run um, not uh, normally I can see some of the uh, there's a little bit of yellow uh, but this time I don't have that much of yellow uh, particles I'm just going to run one more time So again, um, no residue, nothing. I'm just going to finish this one off uh, so that it's completely out. Um, well, I hate to do this, but I had to throw these things away. But uh, I just want to make sure that it's um, completely clean. So now I know the, the system is completely clean, no more uh, yellow stuff for old uh, coffee in this one. I hope you enjoyed the, the little demonstration and enjoy your coffee.